Temperatures cooling down as a storm moves into Colorado. Our temperatures in the 40s and 50s here for the eastern plains, 30s and 40s for the high country. And all throughout this week, we've had highs in the 60s. So this is a bit of a change for us. And it will cool down even more going into the rest of our weekend. The storm moves in Friday night here for the Front Range. We'll have heavy mountain snow really just widening uh, its coverage here as we get into the next 24 hours. A slushy wet snow expected for the metro. We'll have some mixing, but I think the temperature will cool off enough that we'll see some substantial snow here for the metro area and parts south where we do have winter storm warnings in effect for the southern metro down toward Colorado Springs. We have winter storm warnings for most of our mountain towns for substantial snowfall up to a couple of feet is possible. And also winter weather advisories, everything shaded in purple. We are expecting snowfall there, just not as intense as a snowfall we'll get where we see winter storm warnings. Now here in Denver, we are now under a winter storm watch ourselves. The winter storm warning just south of Centennial toward Larkspur and into Kiowa and Elizabeth. Here in Denver, winter storm watch for up to 5 to 10 inches of snow. Off to the west, 4 to 8 with a winter weather advisory into the foothills. So it looks like uh, we're still going to be seeing changes with this storm as it gets closer. Nothing is set in stone. At this point, temperatures look like they'll be in the upper 30s as we get through the afternoon. Now, if this temperature drops a few degrees, this is all going to be snowfall and we'll see more accumulation than what has been originally expected. Now we are going to see the rain start off Friday night and a mix of rain and snow into early on Saturday. Temperatures in the low 40s, but I think most of the day temperatures will stay in the 30s. We'll have 20s and 30s for the high country. Well, that snow will just keep coming down for our Saturday. Temperatures in the 30s from Aurora down toward Parker and Castle Rock, a little warmer off to the north and northeast where we're expecting mostly rain. But here in Denver, we're right on that line where this is so temperature dependent, we could see more snowfall than rain. So at this point, by Saturday morning at about 845, you can see that snow to the south, but we're right on the edge of that rain snow line. So if that shifts just a little bit farther to the north, we're going to see a lot more snowfall. And it looks like the latest models are showing that since we now have a winter storm watch in effect for our area and winter weather advisories off to the west. And it looks like a lot of banding happening in this storm. A lot of yellow areas mean that heavy dump of snow coming in as the uh, moisture pushes across the front range and the eastern plains. So scattered rain showers here to the east. Saturday night, we'll still have snow here for the metro. As for our snowfall totals, we're looking about five to eight inches of snow here around Denver and um, six to 12 possible down to our south and to our west. So we're going to keep our eyes on this very closely as this storm moves into Colorado. We are expecting one to two feet of snow in the high country and rain slushy snow for the plains. It has been warm for this entire week, but on our three day forecast, we're still around 40 degrees on Sunday with a few flurries in the morning and then sunshine is back on Monday with highs in the upper 40s.